In this tutorial, I want to show you the first couple things you should look at if for some reason your sum ifs function or average ifs whatever just isn't working. So here we're trying to make a summary table, right? And for some reason our sum ifs it just isn't working. Looking at the function, it seems pretty simple, right? A sum if of the revenue, which is called f. Okay, so it's picking the right column as you can see right here. That's the revenue column, and we want to do it based on the cookie type, which is in column B. Now, first thing to look at is look at the form itself. You want to one double check and make sure that everything is referencing the right the right column that you're looking to. So many times, if you're doing a bunch of different things, that once or twice throughout the day you're just referencing the wrong column. I've done that many times before. Just making sure it's referencing the proper column. Now, next, you want to make sure that each of your conditions has an array that's the same size. So as you can see, this is going for F1 to F701. This is going from B2 to B7, B701. But hold on. This is starting at the second row. This is starting at the first row. They both have to be starting from the same row because they need to be the same kind of size. Think of it like it needs to be like a rectangle almost for what your formula is using to calculate them. So changes to B1. And hey, it's working. Copy paste this down. And hey, it's working. But oh no, we can see a fortune cookie is not pulling up any revenue or sales or total profit. Well, the next thing to check is the criteria that you're working with. So sometimes you might have criteria that appears to be the same, but for whatever reason, it's not the same. Two big things that I see all the time for a reason why criteria are the same is one, formatting. So if for some reason it's a date, for example, um, as you can see, this is an, this is a date. But if you're trying, if you think you're trying to sum as a text, it won't work. Vice versa, if your summary table, if your, your criteria you're trying to use the text, but you're trying to do sum if based on a date for your criteria, it won't work. So make sure it's the same formatting. Another thing too is just spaces that you don't necessarily see. So the easiest way to check to see if two things are exactly the same is just use equals function. So if the fortune cookie is the same thing as the fortune cookie over here. It should be the same thing, right? We're going to just look for a fortune cookie in our data. As you can see, it's not the same thing. Hmm, interesting. Well, look at the values itself, right? This is fortune cookie, and this is also fortune cookie. But hold on, this doesn't have a space at the end, and this does have a space. To confirm that it's different, we can use a lin function, which just returns the length of the two items. This is 15 characters long, and the fortune cookie item over here. It's, 14, 14, it's just 14 characters long, right? So we remove this space right here. Now they're the same length, and they're the same. And now this works right here. A couple other 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 things that you should try is one, making sure that it is all your data is being referenced. If you have more data that is being added, then make sure that it's referencing the proper range. Also, double check that all your ranges are locked down. If for some reason one of your ranges just isn't fully locked down. What I mean by locked down is by using absolute references. So that way it just stays the same as you copy the range that you're using stays the same as you copy and paste it down. If for some reason one of those in your long sum list isn't working, the function will just not produce a proper result. So make sure that you have the, all the dollar signs where they need to be. And one last thing to keep in mind is that the sum is cannot have a sum range across columns. So as you can see, the sum range right here is from F. 1 to F701. Let's just say this is not F, this was I. This doesn't work. Why? Because the sum range is spanning across multiple columns. The sum range in the criteria range 2 can only be one column long in the sum ifs. That's it. I hope you found this to be helpful. If you did, like, subscribe, comment. Thank you for watching. You have a great day.